The Lord be with you. Good morning, friends. I am so glad that there are so many of us gathered together today. You did such a great job with your quarters, and it's one of the things that I am thankful for. That's what we're going to be talking a little bit about today. My family, sometimes when we sit down together at dinner or when we're riding in the car or when we're thinking about it, we will say, what is one thing that was really good today? And everyone takes a turn saying something that was really good in their day, something that they can be thankful for. Can you think of something that you have been thankful for? Raise your hand. I'll give you an example. The other day, I was thankful that the sun was out and it wasn't raining. That's what I said in the car. Can you think of something that you have been thankful for? Put your little hands in the air. Yes, ma'am. You can tell me. My dog. That's a wonderful thing to be thankful for. What are you thankful for? For rain. Sometimes it is. I was not thankful for the rain, but sometimes it's good to be thankful for the rain. Henry, can you holler what you're thankful for? Watermelon. That is a great thing to be thankful for. That's one of Fiona's favorite things to be thankful for. Yes. What are you thankful for? Emily. Oh, your sister Emily? Oh, that is such a wonderful thing to be thankful for. Yes, sir. What are you thankful for? Trees. Trees? I'm thankful for trees, too. Now, see, sometimes when we say things, we say, oh, yep, got one more. What are you thankful for, Rex? Mommy. Mommy. Oh, that's so sweet. See, just like my family, you guys said some little things that you're thankful for like little things and some big things like mommies and sisters and it's important to be thankful for everything sometimes we remember to be thankful for the really big things right like we're thankful when something really cool happens like we get to go on vacation or we're thankful when something really cool happens like we get a baby sister or we get a brand new puppy it gets to be with us and our family for the rest of our lives. But there are also little things that we see every day to be thankful for. Just like Henry said, watermelon that we get to eat, the trees that we get to see, the rain that helps us live and grow. So today, um, Pastor Joshua is going to read a psalm. That's what we've been talking about all summer long. And that psalm talks about being thankful to God. And it talks about all the big things that God did that we should be thankful for and all the little things that God does that we should also be thankful for. So I want you guys, when you go home this week, to remember to say thank you for the things that are good in your life, for the very big things and also the very small things because everything comes from God. Okay, friends, can you pray with me? See our praying hands together. We say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. All right, friends, if you are going to worship and wonder, you can stand up and head toward the door with Miss Anna. And if you are not, you can stand up and go back to your seats, friends.